360 here, and welcome back to Sour Spade. And um, today we are going to be working on the Nether uh, Hub, because <laughs> we've been working on it for a while. So I'm gonna work on that for a bit, and I'll actually hop into a another world to show you what I have got the idea. For. So see you guys in a sec. All right, guys. So um, this is pretty much the plan for the Nether thing. So we're gonna have a portal in the middle here. I think there's gonna be a portal like right in the middle, like a circle of portals. Then over here, this is the green branch, uh, and we're going to have uh, in each one six uh, tunnels, and this one's going to be a different color. I'm gonna, I just uh, I use, use a structure block to um, clone them, uh, so, so this is going to be uh, probably like blue and red and like yellow or purple or something, and um, they're all going to have, each going to have six, so that's 24 tunnels possible, and then on top though, we are going to have a balcony with, um, with on them, that's where we're going to have our shopping district which is going to be pretty sweet. Well, some of it. We're going to have some of it in the shopping district in the nether, and um, I'm probably going to... I haven't actually decided where I'm going to make the staircases, but I'm probably just going to add them, like, around here. And then also there's going to be an entrance on either side to each branch uh, from this end here. So yeah, uh, I'm pretty excited for this, and uh, let's get going. So it's going to be about 19 blocks tall um, of open space in the middle here. So yeah, I'm pretty excited for this, and uh, I'll see you guys back on the server. So. Uh, we have cleared out this entire area, by the way, guys. Um, these first three clips I have recorded, like, all at once. Um, and, uh, and I've been working on this for the past, like, few days. Not few days, but I've been working on it for a while. Um, and, uh, I've been mining all this out and all that. And, uh, as you can see, I don't have very many items on me, cats, because that happened. So I started to put in the, uh, red nether brick on the side. I have 48 left. Um, and I had everything else on me, and I started pillaring up, and I forgot about the lava in the walls, and I lost all my stuff, including my diamond pickaxes and all that. So now uh, I'm going back, and also my potato shop is um, is losing potatoes, and not because we have customers. Oh, by the way, this is the uh, portal area that we're making right, or he's making right here. He's making the overworld portal stuff. Nice, I envy your pickaxe. Um, <laughs> there's the present. He still hasn't seen it yet. Uh, so yeah, my potato shop is definitely losing its stock a bit because um, <laughs> I've been dying so much. I've died three times and lost everything uh, in my past few episodes. Not for the lava. The first one was because the game kept jumping me around and stuff. Also, this lost its windshield. Um, <laughs> say it so much. This lost its windshield because um, this, uh, it was parked right here. And that was too close to this. And we agreed that it'd be in everyone's best interest for me to just... Uh, pull my um, pull up the uh, food truck a few feet. But the thing is to pull up a food truck a few feet. Um, you see, since the food truck is in Minecraft, you can't drive it. So yeah, I'm just gonna hop on Greg here and head back to my squatty house quick. Uh, yeah, so now you're pretty much caught up. So yeah. Also, um, uh, I also did a little bit of building at my. Uh, new official base, and uh, so I'm going to show that off today, um, but I think I'm going to, before I make new tools, I'm going to set up the official chant enchanter, because I definitely have enough sugar, and I, and well, you, you'll see. Let's pop to my new base. Uh, by the way, the, these haven't connected up to the hub yet, because it's not done yet, but yeah, new base is on its way. I really need to set something up to get to this tunnel faster, because, man... It's just so slow. Yeah, but now we're here, and this pig is still here for some reason. Um, I don't know how it got there. And uh, also, I found a pig man that came through the portal, and I gave him a name tag, which I also lost in the fire. So, um, uh, yeah, it was going to be Craig. Uh, if you guys remember way, way back to the um, to the first uh, to the first single player series that I did when after, before I quit single player twice. Um, and this isn't my cow farm, by the way. I, I'm, yeah, I have a cow farm. What you get, guys? Did do something about it? Yeah, this is the first cow I've actually killed. I got this leather. Um, actually, I didn't even kill it, but... Um, cow farm, bruh. Um, yeah, so I made the cow farm, and man, I had to get those cows from so far away. And, oh, would you look at that? There are some cows that I didn't see before. I had to climb all the way over the mountains. I had to, oh man, do you know how hard it is? move cows. You know how hard it is to move them on a mountain? Up and down hills, caverns, pits, depths, deeps. And, uh, yeah, I'm pretty much... Uh, so I got my insane sugar farm over there. Hang on, I'm gonna increase my rendo distance. Why is that 6? It's supposed to be at 12. Oh, well. Oops. 
wrong one, wrong one. T, that's the one. Reloading resource pack. So yeah, um, after the lag spike from reloading your resource pack, uh, let's see, and then there's just stuff. I also have this anvil up here, uh, and I lost almost all my iron on it. Well, not all my iron, but... <sighs> Did I still name 12? Okay, uh, so I have 15 diamonds. Gonna make a pick, gonna make a uh, shovel, gonna make a sword, and then I'm gonna make some boots. And that's my plan. So then I'll have four diamonds left, but I but I'm gonna keep those in there because I am totally going to die somehow. Because apparently that's my thing. Also, I decided to leave that tree there. Well, I didn't leave it the entire thing there. What I did was um I broke a few leaves until I got another sapling, then I grew it, and then because I like that tree, it's going to be a monument now. Fifteen, I have to, dude, dude, I have I have no levels. Yeah, so I'm I'm basically just gonna stand in front of a um to a mob spawner. We found a few zombies spawners. I'm just going to make an iron sword and stand in front of them. But yeah, I'll start work on that and I'll see you guys in a second. really really like it in here because it's so trippy to just look around and I guess you can see through the mountains and stuff but like it's just so much fun to chop down the sugar cane oh man and I realized that my base isn't really built around this much uh, which I'm, pro I'm probably going to expand on my base a lot but I didn't even need stuff because like I've got like a chest full of it up there but I you know paper so um, oh you can't do it in any pattern anymore I could have sworn you could Oh, no, no, that's with a book. Never mind. You take three paper and a leather, and that's how you do it. Okay. Alright. <laughs> I need a life. Okay. <laughs> Who's hungry? Yum, yum. You too. Is this not the best achievement I have ever received in my life? Look at this. Wow. I feel so accomplished right now. Like, there's nothing I can't do. Sleep!
blaze rod. Now we can make the blaze powder. So what I'm doing right now, guys, is um, is uh, while I wait for like the crops to grow and the uh, cows to get hungry again, I'm gonna mess with somebody, uh, namely uh, Civil Sage Gaming. So I'm gonna make a potion of invisibility, and uh, he's building a path right now at spawn. So I'm gonna place coarse dirt all over, and he's just gonna think he misplaced it or something weird. Uh, it's gonna be hilarious. Hopefully he has his particles turned off, because otherwise he'll be able to see me. But, um, yeah, right, I forgot the golden carrot. Um, I'm pretty sure this is how you make them, with uh, fermented spider eye, golden carrot, and nether wart. Uh, is how you make the potion. Uh, I'm not sure though, I'll have to be checking and all that, but yeah. I completely forgot you needed blaze powder for these things. Um, but I haven't really brewed potions very much. Um, yeah. Thanks. I gave him some obsidian before, uh, and he's got leftovers. Um, keep it for now. Um, digging at my base. <laughs> he lied. <laughs> yeah, so I think for minute spider I should invert the potion to a potion of invisibility. Alrighty. Take the potatoes off my bar. I have to be really careful because you'll be able to see the item in my hand when I'm invisible. Um, actually, wait, if I add redstone to it, I think I can make it last longer. Or is that... I'm not sure. I don't know. I'm just really hyped for this because it'll be fun. Okay, so it's brewing in, so I'll just get back to you guys in a second. Right, the potion is almost done, and... Yeah, now it's eight minutes long. Okay, so now I have... Uh, quite a bit of time. Uh, 24 minutes of invisibility in my hands, but I'm not going to use them all, obviously, but... Alright, let's do this. This is going to be fun. So I'm going to head over to spawn where he is, supposedly, and, um, yeah. Let's do this, guys. So we'll be there in a second. So I can't use the spawn portal because he, he'll see, he'll hear the particles coming out and all that, but, um, uh, or not hear the particles, hear the sound of the portal going off once I go through it, so I have to go back to my squatty house and then, uh, and just, uh, hoof it till we get back to spawn. Which, it's not that far, I guess, but I'm just... This is going to be great. Oh, I should have brought an anvil drop on his head. Hilarious. Uh, I've always tried to get him, get him with an anvil, but I've never been able to. I got, um, I got M. Streams when he played on the server and when he was active, but never have gotten some safe gaming, so... Actually, wait, no, I did. I did get him uh, at his old base in Season 2 uh, when he was in his farm underground. Anyways, I was going to cut until we got to the portal, but we're already here because I'm blabbering. Yay. Anyways... Okay, I'm gonna drink the potion now. Oops. Drink the potion now. And I am completely invisible. Okay, let's go. Alright, so, um, he can, if he has subtitles, he'll be able to see my footsteps too, which is a problem ish. Uh, but it shouldn't be too big of a deal, I don't think. So, yeah, I'm completely invisible. It's great. Alrighty. And now the mobs won't see me, I think, so I can just run past this spider. Hey spider, running right past you. I think if you get all up in their grill though, then you can s then they'll see you. Like if I do this. No, no, he still doesn't see me. Hey buddy, <laughs> I love him. Oh, oh, okay. So he does see you. You get all, all up in his grill. Fair enough. Uh, make my way down the riverside. Oh wait, I probably shouldn't have any items in my hand. Otherwise, he'd see them. This is gonna be fun. I mean, I have no idea what I'm going to do. I'm just going to place blocks all over. Yeah, let me get this on my bar, too. There we go. Just eat a quick snack before we get in there. And let's go. Actually, I'm going to switch these to keys that are easier to hit so I can swap between them faster. There we go. So he should be out here somewhere. Where is he? There he is. He sees me. What's wrong? Is he gonna see me? He's not gonna see me. He's gonna be great. He's hilarious. <laughs> There's another one. I don't think he has his particles on, which is a good thing, because then he can't see at all. 
port. Stop now. Stop what? Oh no, he's on to me. He probably has his particles turned on. Rat! My plan has been blown. There ain't nobody here. What are you talking about? Yeah, he, he knows. Darn. <laughs> no. You can't see me. Ah. Okay. Obsidian Plez. Obsidian Plez. Thank you, thank you. I'm the tax collector now. <laughs> hey, friend. He's looking at me, but he doesn't see me, which is weird. I think you need to fix that. Because they, they still turn their heads to you, but they don't chase you. Oh, well. There's nobody here, sheep. I pat you on the nose! Ha ha ha! I wonder if the cows will see me if I'm holding the wheat. They probably will, because I'd be holding an item. But, actually, don't really think about it. Do they see? Oh, yeah, they do. They see the wheat. <laughs> oh, well. And they're ready to eat again. Eat your food, cows. Yum, yum, yum. No one wants to eat or do anything. No? Okay. Fair enough. Um, Alright. <sighs> what are you looking at? Get over here, cows. Adult, uh, I might not leave any because there are so many of the children. No, they gotta have someone for the children to follow around, right? I mean, watch this, watch this. Boom. Now, all of them will follow this guy. They will not go anywhere without him. <laughs> okay, how much do I have? 14. Drat. That's not even enough for another 5. Oh well. Getting pretty close. We got made quite a bit of progress on the bookshelves. So uh, I think I'm just gonna finish them and then I'll get back to you guys. Alright, so we got all of the bookshelves we need, and I think that should do it. So now it should be 30. Yes, okay. Perfect. I'm gonna okay, I'm gonna enchant the tools and then I'll be right back. Alright, so we enchanted everything we need, and now we've got Scorch, Fire Aspect 2, Looting 3, Diamond Sword. We've got Pickaboo, uh, Efficiency 4, Unbreaking 3, Diamond Pickaxe. Speedy Spade, and Breaking 3 Efficiency 4 Diamond Shovel. Uh, Multiplier, uh, Efficiency 4 and Breaking 3 Fortune 3 Diamond Pickaxe. And finally, Dave. Blast Protection 4, Depth Starter 3 Boots. And yeah, that's my enchantments. So, I think I did pretty good. I mean, Dave and Scorch could be probably be better. I wanted some sharpness on this sword, and uh, I mean, but that's okay. Looting's still really good. Anyways, so uh, that's all I got time for today, guys, but thanks for watching uh, if you made it this far. Um, hope you enjoyed the episode. Uh, leave a like if you, if you can, because it helps me out a lot. And uh, yeah, so anyways, guys, see you in the next one. Peace out, Girl Scout. May the force be with you.